Hey all guys, this is part two of doing Lewis's painting for him. Um, I am a bit behind on this painting because I haven't been well, but we'll get into it. Um, I've had to take time off for personal reasons. Now I'm going with the same colour that I painted the popcorn with, however what I'm doing is, is that I'm going <clears> to, <throat> lost my voice then, I'm going to age the film strip so it's a bit darker and then what I'm going to do is stick um, characters in from like Halloween shows and all that some um, like poster references for the films in here so that way it will be sorry I gotta find my train of thought so it will be um, some horror films and non horror films um, in little, the little slots I'll make. So it'll be a similar process that I did with the popcorn. The only difference is, is how I'll be setting the background. Oh, sorry, not the background, the, the strips for what I will paint into them for later on. This bit might take a bit longer than the last one over the popcorn. The popcorn probably took me about three or four days to do, so I had to get it accurate. The base colour I really work into the canvas so that way the white won't the white gesso won't show through later. So the uh, pencil I'm using is a watercolour pencil to redo the lines that have been painted away by the paint from the background. So that way we can 
um, put in a correct gradient line for the background bits. Different brush. That's twice now I've done that. <clears throat> Sorry guys if I grow next because I'm in, in, in a bit of pain. People, excuse people, people's marching.
Sorry, babe, so I had to make the camera room. Just so I wouldn't knock it. And I did exactly that.
Mm, I think she needs to stop painting. Because my hand is shaking. Must finish. Base color. Switching it off, you guys. I'm done the base color. I'll let it dry and I'll come back probably tomorrow to finish this off. I hope you guys enjoy this video and peace out. Hey, all. Sorry that I've been away for a while. Um, I haven't been well. I painted this whilst I wasn't recording because I didn't feel like recording because I was really not up to it. Um, if you hear tweeting as well as my talking, that's because I have a bird on my shoulder. Um, so yeah, so this is a part of Lewis's painting that I've done. So this is a film strip that I've added some fun stuff to. I've, I'm going to add a few more things before I finish it over. Um, and I hope you enjoy the journey with me. Um, I duly apologise I didn't film this process. I used... Oh, I have to list the colours that I used to create the comic strip to look a bit old and metal Because that was something I was going with. Something that was to stand out in the background. Like the Popcorn Planet logo. And then with movie references and that on the film strip. Right at the end it says recording. It's what you get when you film and stuff. And then Lewis's one of Lewis's channels. So yeah, so in you could probably see in this section of the... Is a knife that's in reference to um, Jason. I will add one that will be in a reference to um, Freddy Krueger from Nightmare of Elm Street. Possibly one more character. Probably like Jason's mask or something. Um, it, it's something I'm fiddling with at the moment. So yeah. And then it will be 100% done. Yeah. It will be. Yeah. And then I'll be moving on to the last part of the background which will be Nuke the Fridge. Which will be somewhere at some point. <laughs> Alright. Cheers guys. Um, I'll, I'll finish this off off camera. Because I'm, I'm, I'm not in the mood to record. I'll probably pop back onto the camera and show you what I've done from there. Alright, peace out fam. Hey up guys, I've finished the film strip for Lewis's um, painting. I had to do it off camera due to having to have the painting up close to my face and I don't, I'm not one of those people who likes to show our face on camera so henceforth why I like to be invisible in the background and this is the reason why I had to do it out of the camera's way because it was such a delicate point of doing the painting away from the camera um, I do apologize during this conversation that we've been having if you've been hearing a bird in the background um, that's my bird being a goofball in the background trying to make me smile and feel distracted from talking to you guys. Um, so yeah, this is a part of Lewis's painting. This is probably one of my shorter videos for this. Um, the next part I'll be adding in his um, reference to Nuke the Fridge. Um, much love guys, peace out and enjoy your day.